Today and all this month, amen. It's just good, but I'd rather be working than doing yes. nothing, amen. Yes. Yes. I'm working for the Lord and not doing anything. Yes. Yes. Some some Christians are dry Christians, and some uh, they can't do nothing until they have rest, amen. Yes. Yes. But I'm glad God has put something on the inside of them. Yes. Most of us who have something on the inside can press on a little while longer. Yes. I know God will give us rest when we need it. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. The book of 2 Timothy, chapter 1, beginning in verse 6 to 10, when you have it, say amen. 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 Uh, some of our other members from the Lord, let me say that, they did not come. One of the reasons why we've been busy last month, this month, and they share with all this, they told me to tell you, they're not mad at you. Because right. they didn't come with me. Amen. amen. Okay, I'll tell them you may have a dinner. <laughs> but uh, they, they didn't come because they have been going. But thank God for one of my deacons, Deacon Black, who has come and blessed the way evangelist me and Sister Black. Amen. Amen. And we thank God. And uh, that's my nephew, one of our musicians back there. Amen. Amen. He, he learned because he learned how to follow me. Amen. Amen. So we thank God for him. So uh, they sent me to, they sent you a, a pie. All right. Somebody yeah. trust. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, Seventeen. And, and today I'm looking like this because we told y'all we had an old fashioned day, so uh, I don't know what they call this. Oh, this is comfortable to me. <laughs> Amen. Used to wear this. I may go back to wearing this. Amen. Yeah, yeah I, I feel good in this here. Uh, don't want to take it off. Uh. Actually, I would have went to change, but I had another friend of mine that was trying to uh, trying to get a church, and I wanted to support him, so I didn't really have time to go on the change. I went after our service. I went to support. Him. Another minister is trying to get a church. Amen? Amen. And I believe we have to support one another. Amen. Amen. In the book of 2 Timothy, chapter 1, verse 1, um, verses 6 to 10, when you have it, say amen. Amen. Say, wherefore I put thee in remembrance that thou stir up the gift of God, which is in thee by putting on of, of my hands. For God had not given us the spirit of what? Yeah. But of power and of love and of what? Be not therefore, be not thou therefore ashamed of the testimony of our Lord. Nor of me, the prisoner, but be not partakers of the affliction of the gospel according to the power of who? Uh -huh. Who has saved us and called us with a holy calling, yeah, yeah. not according to our works, yeah. but according to his own purpose and grace, which was given us in who? Right. Even before I got here, y'all not listening, right. before the world was, yeah. but is now made manifest yeah. by the appearance of our Savior, yeah. Jesus Christ, who had abolished death and had brought life and immortality to light through, and I just want to talk about a stirred gift, yeah. a stirred yeah. gift, or a stirred up gift, amen, yeah. amen, a stirred gift, or a stirred up gift, because, listen, you can have all the gifts you want, yeah. you can have all the gifts you need, but yeah. if nothing don't happen to it, it's just a gift, yeah. oh, I wish I had something, Listen, often we have gifts even before God has saved us. Yeah. If you look at the text, he said he saved us first. Yeah. And then he called us with a holy call. Yeah. Listen, but I'm still dumb and don't know what to do with the gift that he has given me. Watch this, watch this. He has given us gifts. A lot of us have gifts and what we call talent even before we were born again. And some of us don't know how to use the gift because God has not stirred up the gift. I wish I had somebody. Listen, I wish I had Luther. Luther would say a house is 
just a house. Because that can be a chair as long as nobody sitting there. Right. But will it be a chair or will it not be a chair if it can't hold me up? Right. I wish I had somebody. A lot of us, we got gifts, but guess what? Ain't nothing on the inside of the gift. Right. Why? You can have a gift to be able to sing like an angel. Yeah. You can shout out all the crystal you want. Yeah. But if nothing really on the inside of the gift, then there's really nothing going on. Yes. 
pastor. Uh, I wish I had something right now. I'm getting ready to go. Watch what he says. He says, but it's manifested to us now. See, when he calls us, he saves us. He calls us God to his own purpose. That means self got to get out of the way. Some folks can't really use that gift because they won't let self die out. They won't let self decrease. They won't increase. So they hang on to self-righteousness. You can have a gift, but self-righteousness will keep you from being able to use the gift God has given you. Don't you know I said this morning, a lot of folks leave churches and they ain't because the preacher is bad. They ain't because the members are bad. They ain't because the choir can't sing. It's because they in their own self-righteous. It's because they want to do what they want to do. And you can't do what you want to do and still perform God's gift. I can't do what I want to do and God still work on the inside of me. Listen, some got to leave if God don't do the work on the inside. Watch what he says. He says, listen, after he saved us, yeah. he called us yeah. with a holy call. Yeah. With your life on. Yeah. If y'all don't believe me, I wish I had time to go ask you to talk to Jonah about this. Because yeah. Jonah would tell you, I tried to run, yeah. but I just couldn't hide. Yeah. I tried to get far away from God. Shut up. 